Hello. The uh, axles and the spindles on the end are exposed to time, heat, water. Uh, they're when I say time, they're usually long intervals before they're serviced and uh, in between services. And I've always, when I did spindles, front bearings, uh, I would take a wire brush and hit the threads really well. But they're always gunked up uh, from all the grease that you're dealing with and it's old grease and road dirt. Uh, that gets in there. So this is a nice set. Uh, they're these dies and they have openings cut in them. So when you run these on, it's going to uh, pull the gunk out of the threads and uh, leave them clean. So you're going to work them on, work them off until you're not getting anything out of there. And, of course, the first step is to take a good solid rag, like a red rag, and uh, I use brake cleaner, spray brake cleaner on there and wrap around it to get the bulk of anything off and then start working with these and brake cleaner. And a cool feature that this kit comes with, first of all, it's a good kit and it has eight different sizes, but you have this extension that's got a half inch drive on this end and hex drive for a large uh, open end wrench or adjustable wrench. And the dies fit in there and comes with an Allen wrench for this key. And you lock them in place. Gives you a little Easy, easier job, a little more purchase for your hand, turning them on. Or in the worst case, you can use your ratchet or a wrench, but you want to work them back and forth, just like you were tapping. And uh, somebody's review mentioned that these were not uh, real precise threads, and I'm not exactly sure what he's talking about. Precise for the job... These are designed to uh, uh, not cut new threads, but chase threads. And uh, for that purpose, I don't know that we want them exactly precise. But again, I don't know what exactly he was uh, complaining about. But I didn't find that to be the case. Got a handy-dandy size chart up here. Tells you what you got in your uh, box. And the box itself keep all this stuff together and these are quality made tools and uh, they'll definitely do the job uh, but like I said I would do the one two three uh, use a rag rag and brake cleaner and then use the chaser with brake cleaner spraying in there and then rag them off at the end put some lubricant on them and you're good to go Check your nuts uh, and uh, make sure they're in good shape. They usually are because they're not. If, if everything's working right, there's nothing running against them. So give it a try. You'll like it. Cheers.